Hi everybody, welcome back. It is week two. Workout number one on week two. So that means cardio day. It's time to get sweaty, time to push that cardio, and then time to see the gains that we've made. Bring it right here to a warm up with me. Should be getting fairly familiar with this little boxer shuffle. As always, this is our active recovery move right here. So today's cardio session, four Tabatas, one finisher. That's it. Quick and sweaty. Bring this to a jack. Start to open up the chest. Take away that rounding in the back. Back to that bounce. Let's bring it to some butt kickers right here. Switch it in for some high knees. Standing tall. Right here, nice and strong. Back to butt kickers. Back to jacks. And back to that bounce. Heart rate should be starting to come up. But right now I wanna warm up the back side of those legs. So bring it forward right here. Try to extend forward, not like this. Train yourself to stay strong and keep the energy through that spine. Good, bring it back to that bounce. Make it a little bigger. Jacks. High knees. Butt kickers. High knees. Jacks one more time. And back to that shuffle or bounce. All right, I think we're ready. So your first Tabata is a fun one. I want you to let loose a little on this first Tabata. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna break it down really quick for you. Pretend you're holding a massive sledgehammer and you need to hit the ground as hard as you possibly can with this sledgehammer. And in order to do that, you need to fly up in the air first. This is what it looks like. Hold that hammer, jump and slam. Jump and slam. Flying hammer blow. Tabata number one. Give it a little practice and then it's go time. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. All eight rounds, flying hammer blow. You with me? Tabata number one starts right now. Here we go. Three, two, one, here we go. Flying hammer blow, let's go. Jump up as high as you can. Get up there, come on, push. Let's go. Come on, push. Take it to here if you need to. Three, two, rest. One round done. Number two is coming at ya. Three. Two, one, here we go, slam down, come on, push. Here is your option. But each time, again, as always, that power is coming from here. Come on. Five, four, three, two, rest. Two down. Heart rate's definitely up now. Get ready. Three, two, 
One, slam down, slam down. Bring it here. If you need to change it up, keep going. But don't let it come here. You gotta push right here. Three, two, rest. Nice work. Active recovery. Get ready. Three, two, one. Here we go. Slam it down. Come on. No matter where you're working from, you are working hard. This is strong. This is proud. Let's go. Three, two, rest. Halfway through. Four rounds left. Let's go. Three, two, one. Come on. Right here. Get that power and slam it down. Don't let that back collapse. Come on, you've got this energy through the spine. Let's go. Three, two, rest. You got this. Third last round in three, two, one. Slam down. Don't lose that power. Slam it. Come back up and drive. You got it. Come on, push. Come on. Three, two, rest. You only got two more. Only two more. Relax your shoulders. Strengthen that spine. Three, two, one. That's it, come on. Drive. Don't you give up on this. Keep going. You can do this, come on. Three, two, rest. You've only got one more. Longer recovery coming after this one. Get ready, three, two, one. Come on, slam. Come on. Right here if you need to, but finish strong. Come on, push, push. You got 10 seconds left, push a little harder. Come on, five, four, three, two, one. Active recovery. Whew. One Tabata, done. Little recovery here before we head into Tabata two. Next one. You have a little bit of choice. We're doing burpees. All eight rounds are burpees, but I'm gonna show you some variations. You can choose to join me in those variations, or you can work on that straight burpee. No exciting stuff in between. Just the technique of the burpee. Sound good? Are you guys recovered? Burpee time. In. Three, two, burpee, let's go. If you want a bit of a challenge, get right to the ground and right back up. Walk this out if this is where you're at, but I want you to stay strong. Rest, round one's done. Think about working off of just one leg. One leg will shoot back in three, two, one. Here we go. Same side is gonna work the whole time. Unless you wanna stay right here. Either one is an option. Stay on that same leg, don't collapse the core. And rest. We gotta do the other side. Switch to that other leg or stay with that regular burpee in three, two, one. Here we go. Walk this out still if you need to, but don't stop. Keep this moving. Whatever your burpee looks like, that's okay. Rest. 
If you want another challenge, one arm. One arm goes down for the same interval. Go. Again, work on that straight burpee if that's where you're at. Form is everything. So if you're feeling noodly, just switch it. Go to that straight burpee. Now rest. Guess we have to do the other side, yes? One arm. In three, two, one. Here we go. Keep it strong. Drive those feet back and forward. Don't let up. You got five seconds. Rest. Now look, there's three left. I want you to choose your own adventure. One arm, one leg, but go. Straight burpees if that's where you're at. Ten seconds here. Focus on that core. Don't let it droop. Strong frame for three, two, one. There are two left. Switch to the other side if you chose one arm or one leg. In three, two, one. Here we go. Again, these burpees are not noodly. I need you to be really strong. However you're choosing to do them, keep strong through the body. For five, four, three, two, one. You guys know we have one left? Just one. They're gonna be your best ones yet. Your jump this time, hit the ceiling in three, two, one. Here we go, last round. Now look, push. I need you to blast off. Push through those feet. Get a little higher, come on, up. Five, four, three, two. Active recovery. Guess what? Two done. That means we're halfway through our Tabatas. Keep that active recovery. Our next Tabata actually has two exercises. We're gonna alternate back and forth between them. Soccer runs and super runs. They're fun. So look, soccer runs, you are presenting the heel forward. When I'm doing this, I am squeezing to turn my leg out. So here. Then you get to rest, then we switch to super runs. If you've got a low ceiling, I want you to touch it. Look, they look like this. You come up. Just like that. You ready for Tabata number three? Soccer runs, super runs. Get ready. All right, reset. Shoulders back, spine long. Soccer runs in three, two, one. Right here. Push that heel forward and engage through the glutes. Once you've got it, pick up the pace. Three, two, rest. Super runs are next. Get ready to push. In three, two, one. Here we go. If you need an alternative, I need you to get these knees high. Come on. If you're not jumping, that's where you are. Three, two, one. Rest. Soccer runs again. Stay in that active recovery. Get ready for soccer runs. And go. Now remember, keep going. I am squeezing right here to activate that heel coming forward. My glutes are working to push forward. Go a little faster. 
three, two, rest. Super runs are next. These ones should feel tough. You're gonna push that heart rate in three, two, one. Remember, no impact. I just need you to drive. Stay dynamic. If you're not jumping, you are squeezing and making this dynamic right through here. Come on, five, four, three, two, one, rest. We are halfway through this Tabata already. Back to soccer runs. Three, two, one. Again, everything's working in that lower body to present that heel forward. Now go faster. Three, two, one. We gotta get high again. Get ready. Super runs in three, two, one. Don't let up, breathe through it, push. You can do this, come on, push, drive, come on, come on. Five, four, three, two, rest. One of each of those and you're done this Tabata. Soccer runs in three, two, one, go. Now make this a little quicker, pick it up, a little faster. Come on. 10 seconds here. Go, go, go. Present that heel. Three, two, one. Just that super run. And you get a longer rest. Wait for it in five, four, three, two, go time. Come on. I know this feels tough. I want you to push. You can do this. Come on. 10 seconds. Don't stop with that dynamic move. Come on. Five, four, three, two. Tabata done. That means there's only one left. Active recovery right here. We're gonna take this down to the floor for the next one. Two exercises that are gonna require core. Maybe a little bit of finesse, but they are two core exercises. So the first one looks like this, it's called a flare. You're gonna bring yourself down to the ground. You are going to twist through and touch your heel, tighten here to come back. Other side and come back. That is exercise. One, we're gonna offset that with a plank pike jump. This is lower ab intensive in that you need to squeeze in order to bring those hips up. Squeeze to bring those hips up each time. That's your two exercises, okay? Find a comfy spot on the floor, get ready for those flares. Strong frame. Bring it down here. Find that strong frame. Three, two, one. Here we go, flares. Each time I come back to plank, I am resetting my core. Push through. If you need a bit of an alternative, tap that foot down instead of lifting. Three, two, take a little rest. That jump in is next. So we're gonna find that strong frame one more time. Tall plank in three, two, here we go. Lift, reset, lift, reset. Walk this in or keep that dynamic jump. Keep this going. Five, four, three, two, rest. Same thing, back to the flare. So we're down on the ground again. This is tight, this is strong. In three, two, one, here we go. Keep that frame in your upper body nice and strong. 
try not to let it come up here. There is a difference between this and this. Three, two, one, rest. Tall plank, hop-ins are next. Reset, reset. Three, two, here we go. Up. Keep going. As you're doing this, your shoulders are working to stay in a strong frame. Don't let that sink. Stay strong for five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Back to flares. Don't let that frame droop. Come on down. Three, two, one. Here we go. Remember, you can bring it to a tap in that foot. Whatever works for you in your workout today. Five, four, three, two. Take that rest. Back to our plank and jump in. Strong frame, reset. Three, two, one. Here we go, stick with it because we are close to the end of this workout. Keep going. Here is tight. Breathe and push through this movement. We've got under 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Rest. One of each. We're so close to the end of this. One of each. Flares, pikes. Three, two. Here's those flares. Bring it through. Reset. Bring it through. Reset. Each time I'm moving, I am tightening up those lower abdominals. Five, four, three, two, one. Last round, pike jump in. Reset everything. Get strong. Three, two, one. Here we go. Last round. Keep going. Every time you jump in, tighten up. Brace those lower abdominals every time you jump. Keep this going. Five, four, three, two, rest. Give that a shake. Guys, we're almost done. We have one finisher left to do. Do you remember last week on our cardio day, we had a fast feet challenge where we changed direction? Today, fast feet touch the ground. So when I say touch, your hand comes to the ground. Look, hips drop, hand touches down. Fast feet, touch, down you go. Get that heart rate up one more time and you're done, okay? So get ready for it. Fast feet, touch. In five, four, three, two, one, go. Fast feet, touch, come on, up. Touch. Faster in those feet. Come on, pick it up, pick it up. Touch. 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 Come on, go faster. Faster feet. Core is tight. Go, 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 go. Fast feet. Touch. 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 Faster. Hang on to those fat feet for 10, 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You're done. Keep those feet moving. Fast feet. Gets that heart rate up if you're doing them right. Little active recovery right here. Now, don't run off. I've said it before. Part of this challenge, letting that heart rate come down and making sure we've done a quick stretch. Start to roll those shoulders back. You guys, what a great start to week two. Nice work. I want you to roll them forward. Stay committed, just like you are. And we're gonna get through four weeks together. And man, are we gonna see improvements. I can tell already. Round out that back.
Nice work. Stand nice and tall. Bring those shoulders back. Clasp your hands. Bring your hands to one side. Drop your ear to your shoulder. Stretch out right along here. Switch to that other side. Release that. Give me one big shoulder roll. And you guys are done. I can't wait to see you for some agility training in just a couple days. Week two, day two is what's coming up next. See you soon.